Hello everyone, welcome to another amazing live stream. I've got another brand new mod to show you guys, which has lots of new content, lots of new stuff to play with. It could be a lot of fun for a lot of people, really changes the dynamics of the game. Already, we, here we are in winter, we have trees that actually produce stuff in winter finally. I planted them on the wrong day, so they're not actually producing anything, but if I had one more day, one more day to mature, these would be producing me fruit all through winter. Imagine that. I can't remember what kind of trees they are because they didn't produce anything. Uh, like I said, one more day in winter, they would have done it. Hello, there's everyone in chat. Hello, hello, welcome. Welcome, welcome. I may need to adjust the volume, so let me know if I do. I had to change all my stuff around, playing with new stuff, so I need to know what the volume's like. Anyways, we're on the last day of winter, year 104, so tomorrow will be year 105. We can start a new spring with all sorts of new crops. We can see what we have to do. We also have to pay taxes every month, so that's going to be fun. Luckily, I'm ridiculously rich, so that won't be an issue. Uh, for now, let's sell some stuff just so we can see the date change overnight. Here we go. You go away. And off to bed we go. How long it has it been live for? One minute exactly, right there. The volume's okay? Good. As you can see, Haley's a little bit different now too. She's wearing like a red parka or something. Little red riding hood. Little red riding Haley. That's her winter outfit. She wears like a toque and a scarf and some other stuff. Actually, while we're at it, let's go see some other people in town. Because it's the last day of winter. Hello, hello, hello everyone. Hello. Should we drive our tractor? Yeah, we'll go drive our tractor through town in winter. We'll go see what people look like in winter this time. Hello, everyone. Welcome. The longevity mod changes everything. New crops, new trees. Everyone's wearing different stuff. Really changes the whole feel of the game. Hi, Pam. Oh, it doesn't show it over here. Blah. My front yard's a mess. Well, you know how to fix that, right? Clean it up. It's that easy. Pick up the pile of garbage in your front lawn. I'd even pay someone to do it. Uh, let's go see Pierre. Actually, I'll show you some of the new winter crops that are here right now. Pierre, show me what you got. Let's look at the new stuff. Uh, that stuff's all the same, but we now have these ones. Papaya is new. Lemon, olive, banana, dragon fruit, avocado, fig, pear, and persimmon. Uh, I think these three, the fig, the pear, and the persimmon are the ones you can plant in winter that produce you stuff through winter. Like I said, I planted them too late, so it doesn't work. Uh, there's also like lime, stuff like that, but those are for other months, so we gotta get into spring. But I just want to go see a few of the other uh, characters, see what they look like in winter. Let's see what George is doing. Maybe he's got something to cover his bald head. Does he look different? Get out here, George. Oh yeah, he's wearing a toque outside. That's funny. Cover that bald head. Are you cold? They don't make sweaters like they used to. Yeah, whatever, George. Good luck getting your wheelchair around in the snow. We'll go see the mayor. Mayor Lewis. Is DF done with colony survival? I guess they have to go outside before they wear different stuff. Haley didn't, but that might be because she's married. Uh, Colony survival? Yeah, I'm done with that game for now. In case you're wondering, where's kindergarten? Oh, that's long ways back. I doubt I'll ever go back to kindergarten as well. It was fun. Okay, well, no one else is really different. So let's go into spring and plant some new crops. And I'm going to use a return scepter because I can. That's the point of playing on mumps. I have all the stuff I could ever want. Haley also changed my wallpaper. That wasn't me, by the way. I'm really annoyed about that, so I'll change that later. Because it's, it's two-tone pink. Why would I want a two-tone pink wall? Now, how much money do I have? Uh, 7,000 gold tennis sprinklers. You think those would be worth more considering how hard they are to make? Not that I need the money, but, you know... Just because. So, here we are on the first of spring. Let's see what Haley looks like. She probably changed. Yeah, she's back in regular pink Haley mode. So, that's fine. She didn't change anything more in the house. Okay, here's my monthly expenses. These come up now. Taxes, uh, 23,960 gold. Water is 13,750, blah, blah, blah. So, total expenses, 40,000 for the month. Luckily, I have this big number. That's a lot of money. So, yeah, I'm not too worried about that. Uh, let's go see what my trees look like now that it's spring. Haley shouldn't mess with your house. No, she shouldn't, but she does. I don't know what's going on with that tree. One day to mature. All the other ones grew up okay. They're just not going to produce. At least not yet. 
So, let's go buy some new seeds from Pierre. I want to see what these new crops look like. They look really cool, some of them. I'm going to leave the tractor here this time. I don't want tractors. The tractor mod is really good. If you guys haven't seen that, uh, go ahead and look it, into that. It's year 105, not 104. Yeah, that's true. I didn't even think about that. I had to change the plans at the last second. I was going to do uh, like the fall crops. And I was like, well, I'll show you guys something that grows in winter. Because nothing ever grows in winter. So that's cool. But then it didn't grow anyway. So good luck with that. Oh, I did that wrong. Whoops. Actually, I might be able to make that work. So this is what Pierre does when you're not here, huh? Welcome. If you're looking for seeds, you've come to the right place. Can I actually buy any though? He's not tending the shop right now. I might have a workaround for that. That may just work. It's even better than the regular Pierre. That work? No? Nope. Nope, I screwed that up. I'm gonna have to change that. How do I do that? I think I go like this. Back to the farm. Uh, change the time to whatever, one. And then warp back there. These are the problems I normally deal with behind the scenes. Pierre, get to work. Oh, he's still not there. Okay, I'm gonna wait till tomorrow. I screwed that up. Don't worry, I know the workaround for this problem too. Then we'll plant everything we can for spring, hopefully in a nice, efficient order. That's one of the benefits of cheats. You can skip through all this crap super easy and quick. Then it's no problem. Because normally I just go like this. I'll go time, like whatever, 9 o'clock when Pierre's opens and then I'll warp there. And for whatever reason, that seems to work. If you warp there, then change the time, it doesn't work. I don't know why I warped the saloon. I don't want to see Pam right now. I broke the game. I know I do that a lot. Oh, I really broke the game. Look at him. He's in the fence now. That'll break as soon as he moves. Uh, So what's new for spring? Uh, Violet. That's new, right? Violet was never there before. So we'll buy a whole bunch of everything and plant them as we want. Canary melons. 11 days to produce. They look like lemons, I suppose. Pineapples. Remember Harvest Moon when we had pineapples? The most valuable seeds of all. Cucumbers, sure. Canary melons are the most expensive. We got some rice. Canaries for 250. I think the selling prices do change every day. They fluctuate, so you gotta be careful what day you buy and sell on. Or well, at least sell. Pink cat seeds. Did anything else? Oh, we got some trees. Let's look through our list of trees. Cherry, apricot, orange, peach, pomegranate. Those are all normal. Papaya. Uh, summer. Lemon is spring. So we'll do some lemon trees. Uh, probably not that many, but we bought a bunch anyway because we can. Olives. I don't actually like olives, but we're going to do those. Banana is a summer thing. Uh, dragon fruit. Summer. Avocado. Summer. Fig, fig, fig. Lime. Yeah, we got some limes. I think it's three new trees per season sort of thing. So we'll just run through spring here real quick. Watch your new stuff. Do you have stalker in the chat? Who? You or someone else? I feel like you have a lot of stalkers in the chat. There's always someone there waiting for me. Waiting. Welcome, Emma. Emma, is that the winner from the contest the other day? The one and only Emma? Or is that JMac Emma? Oh yeah, I forgot. I broke the game. I can't walk back into my farm right now. Because I need to update one of my things. So how do you guys want to plant this? I want to kind of do it so it looks good for once. Rather than just like a big maximum efficiency crop that's always ugly like I do. So we're going to have to change the layout of this. Just a wee bit. Uh, and I'm doing it the slow way already. Time for a little makeover farm. I think flash effect is off. Yeah, it's off. Good. Okay, good. This will be a nice area for farming. I can see it already. Visualize it. I really wish these things would just delete and not do that, but whatever. Whatever. I've got a chest there. That's going to stay there because I don't want to move it. Those trees will never grow. Lightning rods are overrated and so are kegs. Uh, we need some more bombs. B B mobs. We need some more B mobs, everyone. Bomb? Mega bomb. That's right. It's not plural. And I still did that wrong. Um, bomb. Z. Not plural. Gotcha. Okay, there we go. 1,000 bombs. Uh, the chickens are going to be free range for now. I can't get rid of the Junimo hut. That's one thing that annoys me. I need like the uh, the mod that's like a save editor. That way I can remove stuff like that. Ooh, actually I don't want to hurt those trees though. Because those are my new trees. So, 
I need an idea of how to lay all this stuff out. Oh, don't hurt the trees. I think they're indestructible. So, what do we got? We got one, two, three, six different things to plant and grow. I want to do them in like strips. Why is my tractor down there? Do I have two tractors now? No. Um, so the easiest way to do this is going to be... We're going to do them in strips and rows so we'll just hoe a bit more land. No problem. My olive tree grew... Oh yeah, I'm not invincible. I'm supposed to be. Whatever. That's the first death. Mumps. Easy now. Take it slow. Someone found you unconscious and battered. I had to perform an emergency surgery on you. And you left me lying on the floor after surgery? What is wrong with you? Some doctor you are. Yeah, here's a emergency surgery. No. We're going to put you on the floor. Get better soon. And you can still hold the bomb you're playing with too. Good, good, good job. Uh, what's the mod name? This is a longevity mod. I need to turn... Uh, invincibility on. Oh, it's that one. Infinite stamina, infinite health. See, there we go. That's better. Okay. Now that we got that out of the way, let's figure out how we're going to plant all this crap. Plant a few more bombs while I'm thinking about that. I'm just going to do like rows right here for now. That way we can just look at it all quick and dirty. Quick and dirty. So we'll start with flowers. We'll do a couple rows of flowers starting right here. Mm, something like that work? Yeah, that should work. I think they'll work out nice. And we're going to plant them in order too. That way we know what we're doing. Then the yellow things. Going up. And down. And then whatever these are. Some of those. I can't wait to see what these all look like when they're done. Everything looks so cool. I love new stuff to play with. I'm glad people make these mods, because normally I'd be doing like 104 years, like I would have nothing left to do. I've seen a lot of this stuff. Haven't got all the achievements yet though. Actually, we can look at that in the, what's it called? I can't remember what it's called. Uh, I think in the collections thing, it shows the new crops, does it not? Maybe it doesn't? Oh, it's probably all this stuff down here, because look at all that blank space. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. You think after 104 years I would have had all that stuff done, but nope. I forgot I had the tractor too, so I just seeded all that by accident. Ah, ah, get off the tractor. Okay, we gotta get rid of all these. Uh, where's my pick? I need a new pick. Luckily I have an answer for that too. Because I'm a filthy, dirty cheater these days. Okay, we're gonna get rid of those because I want to plant all the trees over here. We'll plant a little orchard of all my new trees. Where did they go? I feel like I had more trees down here. I didn't have to go back to the store to buy some new ones. We'll plant them over here. How long does it take to grow? 28 days. So those aren't even going to be ready. We need summer trees. Okay, that's fine. We'll go get some summer trees from uh, Pierre. Pierre, I'm back. I screwed up again. And I died in between. Look at everyone over there working out. We should go help them. I wonder what happens if you mess with them while they're doing that. I've never really interacted with these people over here. Breathe in, breathe out. Good. Exercising can be fun. Emily's probably doing ecstasy again today. My arms are strong. Pant, but my legs need work. Just repeat dialogue. That's it. Okay, well, that's kind of boring. I was hoping for more entertaining things from those people. Anyways, let's go buy our seeds for uh, summer. Our summer trees. You lost a bunch of seeds when you died. Oh, is that it? I forgot you lo lose stuff when you died. I haven't died in so long that I actually forgot. Thank you, Smash. Now, trees, right. Focus. Papaya. Uh, what do I have right now? Olive. So I need to plant the other ones. Which were... I know lime was one of them at the bottom. Oh, that one. Lemon. Oh no, summer. I need summer. Damn it. Whatever. Summer seeds. So papaya. Yeah, there we go. And then lemon was spring. Olive. 
Banana was summer. Yeah, what was the last one? Dragon fruit? Summer? Avocado also summer. Okay, so there's extra. Extra summer. Then lime was spring. Those are winter. Okay, we'll go plant those. Back to the farm. Can cheat grow them? Not the trees. The trees don't actually work for cheat grow. See? Nothing. Nothing. I can cheat grow everything else though. So we'll plant the trees down here. Gotta get rid of all that crap. I hate having my thing all cluttered like that, believe it or not. Despite the fact that it normally is, I hate the clutter. Uh, we'll plant them in a nice little row, kind of like that. I don't really know. I'm just going to do something like that and then plant a few in between, I guess. See what this looks like in summer. My ideas are always trial and error. I don't know how they're going to look until we're done. I thought about doing a Skull Cavern episode today too, but I just really didn't feel like spending 10 hours of my life doing Skull Cavern again. Could be fun though, but I've got a few other things I want to get out of the way before I get back to that kind of stuff. What was I planting? These ones? Yes, those ones. And for the sake of symmetry, and then we got to do a few of these. So we'll go around the corner with these. We'll go up and then over. Beautiful. So unorganized and bad. Anyways, we'll go sleep through a few days till everything's done. Oh, we need sprinklers down though too. I forgot about that. And the stone paths in between. We got to have something good to look for. Sprinkler is that one. Iridium. Oh, and I even have the thing on that shows you how far they go. How about that? Because I have so many mods these days that I actually forget most of what I have. Oh, that's kind of annoying. Well, whatever. Just for the sake of symmetry, I'll go like that. It's overkill, sure, but what does it matter? Because I've got unlimited everything I want anyway. Can't walk through those. Those are the bean sticks, but they're for whatever, rice or something today. Good old rice. And you go there. And you go there. Okay, perfect. Now a scarecrow, of course, too. What kind of scarecrows do you want today? Do you want rare crows? We want... I usually go with the aliens. Let's go with these. That's way overkill again. Probably, yeah, one of those can cover all the seeds. Oh, I can't walk in between that one, though. I'm going to have to move that one. Whoops. Wrong button. Ha. <laughs> okay, where's my pick? I don't know why that wasn't working the first time, but... Anyways, that stuff's all watered, so I'm just going to leave that one blank. It's unsymmetrical, but whatever. And... Is that going to cover him? Hmm. I'm going to have to dual scarecrow it, too. I want this to be all symmetrical and nice looking, but now it's not going to be. Not the end of the world. I guess if I hide a scarecrow way over here, it's not really going to matter too much. The guardian of the trees. Why not? There we go. Watch those trees. Everything else pretty good to go. Everything's watered. Everything's covered. So we'll go sleep. Going to move some stuff out of the way because I don't like the clutter. Okay. I really wish right now I had the time change day. We'll sleep for a few days and I'll just grow it instantly just to look at it. Yeah, longevity mod people. I forgot to put the link in the description. Hey, thank you, Bargest Nor. Really sorry about the pronunciation. Thank you. Hey, DF, finally caught a stream. By the way, I'm even older than Denver. That's not possible. That's just not possible. Thank you. Thank you for the donation. Speaking of Denver, I don't think that old man has showed up yet. Not a surprise, he's probably busy doing, you know, real life stuff. That's okay. Anyone else here watching the big fight tonight? I know I am. Super excited for that. Grass? I don't want grass in my stuff. Get out of here. Whoa. Ooh, that was stupid. I shouldn't have swung my scythe around unknown crops. 
Okay, anyways, this is what things currently look like. We can grow them all like magic. Watch this. There's my purple stuff, and my rice is going to be ready to go. Rice, rice, rice. Oh, the Junimos are already coming for it. I didn't realize they were that close. Whatever. They can have a bit of it, I guess. Why not? I do have to go get rid of that, though. That's really annoying. But these are what they look like when they're done. Stupid Junimos. Think they know better than me. That one done. And what are these? Purple. Because in theory, if it wasn't for the Junimos, they're not really doing that much. But if I leave these all, I can grow them all the way, leave them all there and roll all the way through to winter and have every crop, every new crop available right here somewhere. Which is probably what I'll do. I just got to get rid of these idiots. I wonder if I can fence them in. Does that work? I've never tried that before. Hardwood fence lasts the longest. Uh, the trees need space to grow, but... I'm on to new experiments now, so we'll be okay. Actually, if I just go like that... That should get them. The Junimos aren't that smart. That's why the Junimos. Uh, ba -ba -ba, axe to break that. Boom and boom. There we go. All the new crops. Cool. Uh, how do we want to do this? Do we want to harvest some of these to see what they're worth or see what they look like in value? Yeah, we'll do a little bit of that. We'll take just a few. Ooh, the race explodes into big ones. Five of each? It's raining rice. Interesting. Shows you the different values. Cucumbers. Oh, and these keep producing the canary melons. Probably pretty valuable. Okay, we're going to throw this in a bin. Let's see what they're worth overnight. And then we'll play with these again tomorrow. So those two. Those two. Two of the silver quality flowers. Curious enough. Okay, i got to get rid of all this stuff because it's annoying. Oh, and the cucumbers here. I can't forget those. I really should take the time to redo my whole farm at this point, but I don't know if I'm going to. It's long overdue for an overhaul, but I never really play on this file anymore. It's just what I use for my stupid ideas. Good old Mumps and his crazy adventures. Okay, let's go see what that's worth. Instagrow, Cornhub. All the spammers today. There's a lot of people spamming. I'm not really watching the chat that closely, I'll be honest with you. So... Let's see the value of things. Those few eight crops, I think it was, worth 1,479 gold. The longevity mod actually changes the prices slightly. I think it might tax you on them over when you sell them, but you can see it's 156, 104, 57. It's not even numbers anymore. So the canary melons definitely worth the most. The silver quality, two of those, 584 gold. Pretty straightforward so far. No big deal. Join the Discord, it's fun. Yeah, everyone who wants to uh, do that kind of stuff, I have a Discord. You're welcome to join it. Uh, one of the mods can post a link, perhaps, at some point. If not, it's easy enough to find. Also, Twitter, Twitch, blah, blah, blah. This thing, subscribe, like, all the usual stuff, dislike, everything you want to do. Uh, so right now, let's skip ahead to summer. And see what the trees look like. I don't want to plant anything else for spring. Everything else looks good just the way it is. I want to see some of those summer crops. Is there a mod that makes Pam live in a shed and produces beer? Uh, Pam pretty much already does live in a shed, but she definitely can't produce beer. She drinks it. Do you ever pay attention much, DF? Not really. I'll be honest with you. I try to, but depends on what, what I'm playing, what I'm doing. I like eggs. Good for you. I don't think there's any new animals with this mod. Don't spam. Ha. <laughs> you spammers and your attention. Please say my name, DF. Nathan Letonua. I think. Can I get the Discord link? Why, there it is right below you. Martin Mansoor. What's with all the spam? Spam happens. That's what happens. There's a button to Instagrow. Yeah, with CJB Cheats there is. And probably a few other mods. But CJB Cheats is the one I generally use. It's like my base for everything. It's probably the one I've had for longest. And that's this menu. So 
You can change everything, but that's under controls. Grow crops. Oh, you can grow trees. Damn it, I didn't know that. Numpad one. My bad. Okay, next sunny day, we're going to go grow those trees. I forgot about that. I've done that before too. I just forgot. I forgot the pineapples. I did forget the pineapples. Ha, <laughs> that's funny. Okay, let's go get that. Out of the way, child. Those kids drive me nuts. Did I forget to plant them? I did forget to plant them. That's okay. I've got an answer for that. Can I get them here? There we are. Pineapples, not to worry. We'll get it all fixed up right here. I can't believe I forgot that. Good thing you guys are here. I'd be lost without you guys. Do do do. And we'll go two rows. And we'll go like a double row pineapples. Why not? I'm feeling generous. Those Junimos better not be touching my stuff. More pineapples and we'll grow the trees. We'll take a look at everything new. It'll be fun. So much fun. A couple sprinklers. Good enough. Okay, let's go grow those trees and then the pineapples. I might have to change the button on that. It's not really... Oh, there it goes. Oh, damn it. Stuck in the tree. Don't grow trees on yourself, kids. That's a lesson. Um, okay. And I just did it again. Good. I was watching the chat at the same time. That always kills me. 20 new people in Discord? Good. Everyone join the Discord. Go say hello. Make the mods work. Earn that money. Yeah, in total, I think I have 10 mods on right now, believe it or not. I've got all sorts of stuff. Most of it you can't really see right now. I think it'll crash the game if I go to some of it. Man, you gotta look, walk like right up to these trees to make them. And then you get stuck in them. That's okay, we'll grow the rest of them. Junimo cruelty? No, it's not. Junimos don't have rights. They're not real things. They're like magic beans. I'd sacrifice them all if I could. Actually, I'm going to get rid of them pretty soon. Shout out from Nanaimo across the strait. Hello, Nanaimo. Haven't been over there in a while. It's been a few years. Island folk. Hi, please answer. Zoro King, are you talking to me? What do you want me to answer? Okay, there's some new trees. Everything's all grown up. Um, oh, except the pineapple. Let's get to those. Pineapples. There we go. That looks good. Oh, they give you multiples too. So that was four or five. So they give you two or three pine pineapples per bunch. We'll see what those are worth. I'm going to have so many crops. It's going to be great. Never had a blue chicken? Lee? Well, that's pretty bad odds. I think you have like a 25% chance of getting a blue chicken. So every four, you should get one, roughly. You are the best. Thank you, Theodore Davids. Three ninety-five. There you go. Two hundred seven. One hundred three. Eighty-five. Not too bad. I can't remember what I did to buy them. How much they costed? See, normally when you play with longevity, you would start right at the beginning, and then you're taxed on everything. It just makes it harder. You got more to think about. You're taxed at the end of every month. You're taxed on everything you do. There's some of our fruit now. I wasn't paying attention to what trees are what, so these are apparently lemon trees. When life gives you lemons, you throw a party. Lemons, the most sour of the fruits. I wonder what happens if you give those to people. I'm going to try that. Let's skip through a few days. I'm going to go give some to people. DF, are you Canadian too? I am. Very Canadian. So I'll go give some of those lemons to people in town and see if they react the same way. Starting with my stupid wife, Haley. That's such a stupid gift. My homegrown lemon. Haley, you and I are going to have a problem. Incarnadine Queen, thank you. One dollar. Thank you very much. Mm. 
Well, okay, here's what we do. Like I said, when life gives you lemons, you give your lemons to Haley. When Haley doesn't want your lemons, you get a divorce. Good morning, just here for the usual. I like how painless that is, so easy. What's the name of this mod? Longevity mod. Longevity mod. It was recently updated. Works very well. Very easy to install. Go to Nexus mods. Look for it there. I don't have the link for it offhand. I forgot to put it in the description like usual. Bye, Haley. It was fun. Did you take the run with you? Where is it? There it is. The monster. Do you like lemons? Well, it likes lemons. It can hang out for a little while. Whatever it is. What's its name? Did I name it? Where do I see my kid's name? Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, I named it item numbers. That way I could get me items. I remember now. Uh, so, pineapples, farms, anything else producing its fruit yet? Oh, yeah, I can't walk through those. I keep forgetting. So, the juniors are actually stuck around the fence. That's good to know. Unless they just aren't wanting to get out. Where's all my other stuff? Let's give it a few more days, see what happens. Bishlap Haley. I want more kids. I'm lying. Of course, I don't want more kids. Kids are the enemy. Last I heard, DF was 27. DF is still 27. Last I heard. And I'm no guy on the inside. What's the Discord? Uh, the link is somewhere there. I would copy paste it into the description right now, but if I click off the window, it's going to minimize the game. And that does screwy things. It takes me a sec to get back and just disrupts the stream. So I won't post it. There it is. Kira's on it. Thank you, Kira. Why does rice need water from a sprinkler? I don't know. I don't know anything about rice in real life, to be honest. I don't know much about anything. Just a guy playing games. Will you please play Dream Daddy? I already did. I played through it. There wasn't a lot of creativity or options available, so I didn't really didn't really like it. Who's gonna win tonight? Uh Mayweather. I want McGregor to win, but I, it's just probably not going to happen. There's too many things working against him. I would love to see it happen, though. It's possible, but not plausible. Not probable, rather. Stupid grass. I really wish there was something to make the grass go away. Hey, you eating my pineapples? I forgot about the scarecrow. Is there something in those trees? What is that? Oh, it's a rare crow. I was looking right through it. Oh yeah, I guess I could plant the rest of the spring trees too. I forgot. Yeah, we'll make those grow. Let's go buy the spring trees. I'll, I'll make them grow. And then we can see those real quick. Hopefully by the end of summer. Get out of my crop. Stupid bird. You know how hard it is to make those grow? Jesus. Uh, okay. Rare crow, rare crow, rare. Yeah, we'll throw an alien down. To keep it fresh. Okay, let's go see Pierre and buy the spring trees because I forgot to do it earlier. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, I totally did that wrong. I was watching a chat. Would you guys... Uh, I know I think I asked last time, but now that I have a bunch of people here, would anyone be interested in seeing another like Big Skull Cavern run, like Floor 3000 or something? It would take like 8 or 10 hours. But if people would actually watch it, I would probably actually do that. Okay, I screwed that up again. Or it's either that or like I could try and just like set a record for like the community center and the million gold challenge all in one or something. And then people have to try and like or could try and beat it from there if they were interested in it. Something like that. Just trying to think of like new fun ideas. I still got lots, but I like to change it up. Think of new things. See what works. See what doesn't work. All sorts of stuff. Pierre, could you be behind the counter, please? Thank you. See, you got to do that in the right order. Otherwise, it doesn't work. Okay, where's my spring trees? I want to see the limes. That's what I'm most uh, excited about. The limes. Lime. And what were the other ones? Lemon. Those are regular olives. I think there was one more for spring, was there not? Olive. Summer. Dragon fruit. Summer. Avocado. Well, I've already got one of them. Papaya, summer, whatever. Okay, I'll take these three. That's fine. Because I think I already have the lemons growing anyway, because that's what that is. 
So we'll check the other two. We'll plant them over here in my little orchard, whatever you want to call it. Isn't that too close? It'll be alright there. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Pretty exciting stuff so far. That one and... Stupid grass. So annoying. Look at all my animals. Someone should take care of them. Anyone want to take care of my animals for me? I'll pay you. I'm just kidding. It's not worth my money. The animals can die for all I care. Lime. 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 There we go. Now to try and do this without becoming one with the tree. Oh, I already had those, didn't I? Unless they just look the same. I thought limes were a spring, though. Why are they not producing? Are they producing and it's just blending in? I don't know. That seems odd to me. Maybe they just look the same? They have the same, like, appearance? God damn it. That's so annoying. Nexus mods, there you go. Smash Egg has posted the link in the description. You're gonna have to scroll up to see it because everything I see is delayed. <clears throat> I will post it. This video will be uploaded afterwards and I will, uh, put the proper link in the description at that point. I just didn't know because I'm stupid. Anyways, let's see what Summer's got for us. That's tomorrow already. Can you say my name, please? Tal Yorky? York? York? Probably. Tal York? There you go. Okay. Let's get rid of everything else for now. And go buy Summer Seeds. I think summer is the best looking month, honestly, in this game. Okay, there's my total expenses. Taxes, 20 grand again, 21 grand. So the taxes, I guess, are probably on the crops sold or money earned. I'm not sure how they calculate that yet. Uh, water and electricity, obviously, is just for your probably house and family size. Luckily, I've reduced my family size. So total expenses, 32 grand. And balance after expenses, I think that's 7 billion. Because uh, that would be... Three, six, so 21 million, 721 million. Not too bad. Everything dies. Nothing wants to stay alive. It's ever rice. I guess rice transfers too. And look at the fruit. Bananas. Bananas are ready to go. And I think that's the dragon fruit probably. And those are limes probably in the trees. Delicious limes. Lime is great in real life goes well in drinks that's all i ever use it for food too some food but lime goes in drinks that's what it's made for hi stupid okay uh let's go to pierre's store change the time before you warp gotta remember to do that pierre's okay time for those summer crops so what do we got have i been to holland i have not Perhaps one day I will make it there. I would like to see it one day. So we got lettuce now. Can I get rid of pineapple? That's going to confuse me. So, what did I say? Lettuce? Buy a whole bunch of those. Cassava? Those sound familiar. I can't picture what those are though. Cotton? Uh, we already have rice. Sugar cane? Blue mist? They had so many new seeds to this. I love it. So many new things to play with. Like, I want to start a new file now just to see how much money you can make with this. Panic. Hello. Nice drool. Because it'd be interesting to have more choices for different crops. They grow at different times. You could time things differently. It'd be really cool to see. Uh, We'll do the pink ones here because I feel like they're going to look the best. Do you like how I have my tractor and I'm not even using it? So useful. Ooh, black. Black seeds. Okay, let's uh, organize things so I remember what I planted. We do green things here. I think that's a lettuce. What does lettuce look like? We do these ones here through all of these. And then the one other one's over there. I like how they even do like, even make the seed textures look different. They put a lot of work into this mod. I like it. And then we'll put the blue things over here. The rice can stay there because the rice grows month to month. Then we'll see what it all looks like. Actually, one thing I did forget to do that I wanted to do all the way along was make a stone path. Because that looks cool. Something like that. 
because that's one of the things uh, in my thumbnail. That's uh, Kira sent me a screenshot. That's what I made the thumbnail out of. And she had this kind of look in her field and I liked it. So I was like, well, I'm going to replicate that. Just to make it more aesthetically pleasing because my farm usually looks so terrible. Because normally I just grow for efficiency and not for like visual appearances. Mm, that chest looks out of place, but I don't feel like moving it. I don't got time for that. There we go. Now let's just give it a few days and then we'll just make everything grow magically. There was a larger map he has too. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I could do a whole playthrough on like a whole giant like expanded farm. I could have different crops, different fields everywhere. Like I could make this game huge with all this stuff. Stealing my stuff. Yeah, that's what I do best. That's what this community is for. I'm like, give me your ideas and stuff and I'm going to steal it and make it look like my own. Okay, let's see what this looks like. All matured. We'll make it all grow up. So they even, yeah, they even put the work into like the crops on the way to maturity. They're not mature yet, but they're getting there. Yeah, they went full on on this mod. Like this is, this is well done. I'm really impressed with this. And it's so easy to install, like for the crops and stuff. All you got to do is just drop it into your mods folder. There's a little bit of overwriting stuff, but just drag and drop it into the matching thing. Easy peasy. That's one of the other things I'm going to do. Make a video on how to install a lot of these more complex mods. But I need help for that because I'm not good at doing it myself. So here's what it all looks like. This is a typical summer day. <clears throat> Are you okay with me sending you 500 US dollars? Yes, that's encouraged. In fact, that's the cost for watching this stream. Everyone has to send me 500 US dollars. Bet you didn't know it's a paid stream. These are all the winter seeds. Uh, winter trees. We'll get to those. So these are the dragon fruit. Am I right? Yep. Dragon fruit. A fruit that looks like a dragon egg. Never had dragon fruit. And those are the limes. Bear Grylls said this is the best fruit. Well, so did Dangerously Funny. What a coincidence. Or is it? Bananas, if you happen to find a monkey, you can feed him this. Now I want a monkey. We'll sell a few of these and then we'll skip on through. What are those? Cotton. Plant these, soldier. Private cotton? That sounds vaguely familiar. Is that a full metal jacket reference? What am I thinking of? Cassava. Not that famous, but still delicious when fried. Uh, the blue, s blue mist. Often a popular present for young ladies. These star-shaped blossoms blossom on bloom on the hillsides. Okay. Watermelon. It's round, it's green, and it's a lettuce. Oh, that's a lettuce. Wasn't there watermelon? Didn't I see that? Is that fall? What am I thinking of? Oh yeah, so it's fall. Watermelons in fall. I wonder if I need to get giant. Does anyone know if you can do giant watermelons? I'm gonna try that. I'm curious. Um, You know what we're gonna do right now? We're gonna go run around town, see if anyone looks different in summer. And give them some of these uh, new fruits and vegetables. Anyone? Anyone out and about? Where's everyone? Pam? Does Pam look different? No, she doesn't. She gets a dragon fruit. Because she's a dragon. You've already given Pam a gift today. I have not. I never give Pam gifts. She's lying. Don't listen to the game. Ooh, hello. You. Kent. Hey now, this is a really great gift. Thanks. You're welcome. Where's Leah? Let's go see Leah. She's everyone's favorite. Am I friends with her? Friends with everyone. Jazz looks different. Penny looks different. Yeah, a few of the characters. Leah looks different. Everyone gets remodeled. Elliot. Yeah, there's definitely some people that look different. Um, here we go. We'll make friends with everyone. That way we can go find everyone and see what they look like. So much easier making friends this way. Clicking, clicking our hearts. Marnie? 
And we can also track them using this mod too if we want to see where everyone is. Uh, not the same mod, one of the different mods I should clarify, but all we gotta do is click over here and it will show me where they all are. Okay, can we go in there now? Is it still locked? I think our door opens at 10. I'm gonna wait for it to naturally do it, otherwise it screws up everyone's schedule. Right now there's 666 people watching. Isn't that a fun fact? 666. Okay. Leah? Ah, there she is. She got like a red hair. She got like a, a red hair? I have one good eye for wild fruit. Someday I'll make you a nice fruit salad. You, can you make it out of bananas? This is a really nice gift. Thank you. Okay, cool. Make me a salad. I'll be waiting. Let's go see Elliot. Elliot doesn't get enough attention way down there on the beach. What is this? A heart event? Do you guys remember your lines? No. Why is Clint in this? Yes. I don't know what this is. This is going to get crazy. Ready? Action. What? What's happening? Why are they filming? It's an adult film. That's really the economy that props up Stardew Valley is the adult film industry. I thought we had something special. I guess I was wrong. I, I, uh... Use your words, buddy. That's what your mouth is for. Cut. Fire him. I'll step in. I got this. I'm sorry. You should be. It's hard to remember my lines when your face is right in front of me like that. Well, you're not going to be a very good actor then, are you? If you cannot act around other people, you're screwed. Oh, hey. Hi, Shane. Check out my new camera. Jojico is having a video advertising competition. The prize is 10,000 gold. I'll give you 20,000 gold to leave me alone right now. Hey, I want you to be in this shot, okay? Uh, do I get paid for this? Because I feel like you're making money off me. Just walk by Clinton and Emily in the background while they're talking. I'll give the scene a little bit... It'll give the scene a little bit more authenticity. Yes, because clearly they're great actors and this is going to be great authenticity. Okay, ready? Oh, you guys are seeing higher numbers than me. Action! I thought we had something special. You said you would leave me for anything. I guess that was a lie. And I just casually stroll on past. Hey, what's up? No big deal. Totally not acting right now. No, it's not like that. This is just something I have to do. It's very important to me. He's got to go slay the dragon because he's a chainmail wearing knight. Hi, Blake H. Hi, I see you. Stop spamming. Hi. I've just got to try new Joja Blue Cola. It's got three times the sorbitol for a thick, sweet blast. And we're back to adult film dialogue. It's cheaper than water. Well, but, but isn't so damn healthy? You promised me. Have no fear, my dear. The world-class science team at Joja headquarters have determined that Joja Blue does not cause a significant erosion of the stomach lining. So you can drink it whenever you like as much as you like. I'm going to give it to my kids. That's all they're going to eat. The real question is, when will you turn blue? Glug, glug, ah. Uh, cut. Way to go, guys. You just made Joji Cola a million dollar commercial for nothing. That was perfect. Thanks for the help. Shut up, Shane. Go away. You're too drunk to be filming. Clint? He turns blue. That's funny. I didn't know we could do that. I've never seen that one before. Oddly enough. That was fun. Now, we're going to see Elliot. Oh, uh, are we getting another heart event? Yeah, I put everyone's hearts up to max. I forgot. Sniff. Don't care about your problem, Alex. But you can have a blue whatever this is. Hey, awesome. I love this stuff. You've never seen it before, you liar. It's the first time it's ever been grown in Stardew Valley. And I see you to visit. Oh, dear. My shoes are filled with sand. If your shoes being filled with sand is a problem, you probably want to relocate somewhere that's not on a sandy beach. That's the trouble with living on the beach. And here is a cotton for your trouble. This item gives me a terrible feeling. I'll have to dispose of it. Okay. You do that. Anything new going on over here? No? Yeah? No? Nothing? Nothing. If I was thinking ahead, I would have done a giveaway for this uh, live stream, but I wasn't. I guess I still could. I don't have anything to give away right now, though. It works better if I put it in the title anyway. That way people understand. Who are you? Is that Sebastian? What's going on with your hair? I definitely don't want to go swimming, if that's what you're going to ask. <clears throat> Is that, like, 
reverse psychology. Something I do with my parents. Be like, yeah, I definitely don't want ice cream or anything. Oh, you just stopped by to say hi? Sorry. No, I didn't. I want you to have whatever this is. Thanks. I like this. Go swimming with it. Abigail? Want a dragon fruit? No, I gotta sell one of those. You get a banana. What am I supposed to do with this? Ooh, resist the dirty jokes. This is a family-friendly stream, everyone. Make your own jokes. Just... I can't say them. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Okay, I'm gonna sell this stuff. Give us a picture of your face for a giveaway. Oh, I'm not doing that. Remaining anonymous forever and ever. Okay, I'm gonna sell this stuff. We'll see what it's worth. Sugar cane. Eat all the sugar. Just wanted to send some love from Vampiric Studios. We're watching with joy. Awesome. Thank you very much, Vampiric Studios. Five dollars. Thank you so very much. Okay. Uh, oh, I forgot some limes. We'll see what this is worth. Then we'll skip on through to fall and see what the fall stuff's like. And then even into winter because stuff grows in winter now. At least the trees. You're still stuck with the winter seeds for the winter stuff. Uh, here's what it's all worth. Uh, you see the values of things there. You can just pause it if you want to watch it. Avocado. The super fruit, whatever you want to call it. Sugar cane. I bet sugar cane would be so cool to actually grow. It's probably so good, like raw and fresh. What the hell happened to Seb? I know, he looks weird when he's not like black hair. Is this a mod, the extra crops? Yeah, the extra crops is a mod. Same with the different appearances. Same with the taxes at the end of the season. Same with the bills. The kid, unfortunately, was mine all the way. Though, have fun proving that. Sorry, son. I got rid of your mom because she didn't like lemons and changed the wallpaper. You'll understand one day. They need to make a mod where you, like, generationally pass through the game. Like, after, whatever, 20 years, you become your child and grow up. Though, 20 years is a long time. What does that take? 20 years, I think, takes... Um, about three hours if you were to just skip straight through it. Something like that. I'm back. Hi, welcome back, Nathan. Litton J. Hue. Gotta make the fall. You have to pay taxes? You do have to make taxes. Dangerously funny is not the father. Yeah, Kinseed is, is gonna have that generation thing going on. At least when I'm skipping through days like this, I can talk with the chat. Yeah, Kinseed's gonna be good. I'm really excited for when that's coming out. Any updates on that lately? I admittedly haven't looked in a while. If they update it, I'll play through more demo and stuff. I really like that. I think it's, I think that's got good potential. <clears throat> it's like Fable meets Stardew Valley sort of thing. Whimsical hilarity. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. I'm going to get rid of this kid pretty soon. One prismatic shard and it's gone. Mod to make your kids useful. Yeah. Yeah, you should be able to turn, like, you should be able to turn them into Junimos. Have, like, a child hut. When, when you, heart, like, harvest crops, they, like, hop out of their hut and go harvest and go back in. Ariana Lee? Shut it. Talk to me. Notice me. Wah, wah. Yeah, you sound like a child. What map would you recommend? Forest farm or regular farm? Uh, the forest farm's a little bit nicer to look at. But if you're just going for, like, regular gameplay growing crops, just do the regular. You get more room. DF sounds like a drug. DF is a drug. I'm your biggest fan. Shane X Pam. Yeah, that's right. I'm not your biggest fan. I know that. Believe me, I know. Uh, last day of fall or summer. Let's go take a quick look around just so people who join late can see. This is what the summer crops look like right now. Uh, we got sugarcane, lettuce, cassava, cotton, rice, blue mist. 
And those are limes, dragon fruit, bananas. I feel like I'm in preschool, like naming fruits. And vegetables. Got a Junimo pen. I should make a Junimo petting zoo. DF, ignore everyone. I can't. That defeats the whole purpose of a live stream. Okay, let's uh, do the fall stuff now. Quick look through all that. Then we can look what everyone looks like in winter. What? Who are you? Go away. Ooh, okay, puff pant. That was quite a workout walking all the way up here. Yeah, that's like 100 meters. Good work. Anyways, I came by to ask you if you wanted to have dinner with us tonight. You don't have to, but if you decide to come, could you please bring a large amount of bass with you? That's not an unreasonable request at all. That's right, one of those big slimy fish from the lake. I need one for a casserole. Don't forget the bass. Man, she's weird. Okay, like, hey, yeah, I'd like to invite you over for dinner. Just bring this obnoxiously hard to catch and find fish. That's in real life being like... Yeah, uh, I'd like to invite you over for dinner, but could you bring a white truffle with you? Otherwise, we'll be really disappointed. Thanks. I don't like Jody. I feel like she overplays everything. She always acts like she's super busy and has a lot to do, but she doesn't. I've watched her. She doesn't do anything. Okay, let's go get the fall crops, and we will go see Jody tonight for a largemouth bass, perhaps. That might be fun. Am I using a mod? I am. The longevity mod. Mm. That's how I roll. Iridium quality only. Yeah, I'm using a whole bunch of mods to get this all done. There's actually 10 mods, I think, on my game right now. I did that wrong already. Oh, there's my taxes. Uh, we didn't look at those because they're not important anymore. It would have been the same. Taxed about 30,000 gold and I have like 100 billion million trillion gold left. So, all good. Don't worry, I'm not starving. One thing I don't like about the uh, CJB cheats, if you increase your movement speed, you move too fast and can't control anything. And we get another heart event because I was stupid and raised everyone's hearts up to 10. Is there something back there? Found Pierre's secret stash. What does he have? Adult magazines? Hey, who's in the bedroom? Just me. No big deal. I don't know what, what I'm doing in there, but... Hi, Pierre. I like your adult comics. What? How'd you find that? It's Mump's fanfic. Quick, give it to me. <laughs> is, is that what I think it is? Don't tell me that when I'm in the bedroom. Promise you won't tell anyone about this? Your wife deserves to know about this. You would really do that to me? You're terrible. You shouldn't have been snooping around in my bedroom in the first place. Nosy neighbors are the worst. Yeah, they are. Can I have some free seeds? Then I won't tell anyone. Does DF announce his streams on Twitter? Uh, sometimes. Grumble? Now we have to find a new hiding spot. Grumble? Yeah, try to knock the bookcase. Vampiric Studios, thank you again. Two dollars. We had an extra dollar, so I decided to send two. Stop telling me how to live my life. Do we have another heart event going? No, nope, no time for this. I don't care about your problems. Whoops. Give me the seeds. Where are you? Why are you not here? Okay, I gotta go to the next day. I gotta go to the next day. Stupid heart events screwing me up. I can only play through so many of those before I get bored of other people's problems. 9am, warp location, Pierre. This should be better. There he is, as per usual. It's Farmer Mumps. Hey, remember when you caught me looking through your porn yesterday? So, what's new for fall? Artichoke? Oh, I'm gonna get rid of all the old seeds first, otherwise I'm gonna screw that up. Such a waste. So, new for fall, we have artichokes, carrots, uh, red peppers are new, because normally they're hot peppers, right? I suspect watermelons can't get giant, maybe, maybe not, well, we'll see if we can make that work. Onion, uh, cotton we already have, purple sweet potatoes, that's interesting, and peanuts. 
Anything else? There's a lot for fall. I feel like they went all out. Gotta make it all the way to fall before you get to reap the benefits of this mod. Where's my hoe? Uh, we gotta cut the grass back too. Everything's getting in the way. I can't wait to see what these ones look like all done up. It's gonna be great. Artichokes are in the main DF. Are they really? Oh, I completely forgot. Okay, fine. Artichokes are going away. Well, I was kind of wondering when I looked at them. I haven't planted them in forever. That's why I couldn't remember. It's been so long since I actually just like farmed. With fall, it's always cranberries or pumpkins. I never do anything else. Good to go. Just got to tune up my messy little crop. Do, do, do. Okay, we'll do hot peppers down here. Or uh, red peppers. What are they? Red peppers. I knew that. We'll do carrots right here because carrots deserve to be right here. Second from the left. And then... Oh, I forgot to go see what's her name yesterday. Whatever. I'm going to expand this one a little bit because I want to see if these will go giant or not. I don't know if they will. Probably not, but I'm curious. It'll be a happy surprise. And then what do we got? Onions? We'll do some onions here. Delicious, delicious onions. And then we gotta do two separate crops over here. That's okay. Peanuts. Now let's give it just a few days. Uh, I feel like those are uncovered by scarecrows. Let's add a scarecrow over there. We'll throw another alien down. Like I said, aliens are the best. Everyone knows that. Oh, actually, I have a scarecrow over there, don't I? Yeah, never mind. I forgot there's one hiding in the trees. Okay, let's get rid of everything. Declutter everything. And we'll go take a look. Pop, pop, pop. Uh, give it a few days and we'll see what everything looks like. Mature, harvested. See what its value is, see what it looks like. Then we'll skip ahead because I want to see what the winter things look like when I actually produce. That's such a good idea. They really need to add more winter stuff. That's where everyone stops playing. They play through the whole first year and love it. Winter gets so slow, they stop playing. They really need more stuff. People mine and do Skull Cavern, but it's not enough to occupy 28 days. 28 days at 14 minutes each. You gotta have something to do. Time for a drink. My voice is getting dry. So we'll skip through a few more days while I creep on the chat and don't say anything. Can someone check for me? Can one of my mods check for me to see if anyone else is playing Stardew Valley right now, streaming it? <clears throat> It'd be fun to direct 600 people to someone else's stream, if you know what I'm saying. Okay, we're at the 11th. Let's see what's grown up and then we need to uh, grow the rest of it up. So bell peppers, onions, purple sweet potato, peanut. Most of this stuff's ready to harvest. It grows pretty quick. These aren't. Cotton's always ready because it's cotton. Carrots are ready to go. Watermelon still needs some time. Those ones aren't even getting watered. That's okay because watch this magic. I like the look of the watermelons. Everything else is ready, right? So nothing else needs to go. So the fall crabs grow really fast. That's for sure. Lee, I could, but I won't. Helpful as always. Thank you. Three hours to go till Connor versus Floyd. Yeah, I'm super excited for that. Super excited. Definitely going to be watching that very intently. I just want to clear the grass. It looks really bad. I hate when it like comes up on my crops and fringes on things. You know what I mean? 
there are two more people streaming Stardew Valley right now. Interesting. Interesting. I found someone with two viewers. Perfect. Maybe they want a little spike in viewership. Anyways, this is what everything looks like. This is the fall crop. I'll just hold still right now. Where's all the fall trees? Did I plant those yet? I don't think I did. Uh, let's go see Pierre. We'll do the fall trees. I don't think I have those planted. We'll just walk there. Full speed ahead. Boom. Gaming Crusade and Kev Gooey. Interesting. Oh, who's this? Why are you so blue? Shane, he's wearing a hood. That's better that way no one has to look at you. Leave me alone. I thought we were friends. We're ten hearts and that's how you talk to me? Penelope? No? Leave me alone? Oh yeah, Evan's mad because I divorced them. Now I remember. Including him, Mumps. Um, hi. Hi, you want a diamond? This is cool, thanks. Something for you to talk to, champ. No more movement speed. Uh, it's locked. Oh. Jumped the gun on that one. Gaming Crusade is streaming. Small spike of about 3,000%. Yeah, really. Small spike. Okay, where's all the fall ones? Were there no new fall trees, actually? I don't remember seeing any. Olive. Lemon. Yeah, I don't think there are actually any new fall trees. Because these are all regulars. Okay, fine. No new trees for fall. We'll get over it. We'll go harvest some stuff. When you work hard but still don't get noticed by senpai. Yeah, it's a tough life. I'm just going to take a few of these. Oh, they're renewable anyway, so they won't go big. So never mind. Uh, we're going to do cotton again just because we can. We'll sell some of these. See how it goes. So again, if you just joined us, that's what all the new fall crops look like. And assorted trees over there from different seasons. Watermelon. Man, this is heavier than I thought. It's full of water. Maybe you could try to feed it to a rabbit. Not as spicy, still really delicious. Here comes the bad breath. Mega bombs, peanuts, a hard shell but delicious inside. Eat this with chicken to become a bodybuilder. Purple sweet potato. Okay, well, let's sell it see what it's worth. And I wouldn't catch up on the mail, but I've got a few years to go with, I think. Mm -hmm. Okay, what do we got? 1,800 gold from just those few things. There you go. Uh, there's the breakdown of things. The watermelon's the most valuable. You got four of those. I guess they produce multiples because there's five of them that I got, which is good. And they're renewable. I don't know what their growing schedule is, but uh, there it is. Oh, there. What did I sell? Oh, I sold the Mega Bombs. I was like, why did I make 50,000 gold there? Now I get it. Well, now what do you want to do? Um, I want to skip ahead to winter real quick. Oh, they even have different colors. Cool. Let's skip ahead to winter. I want to see what the winter trees look like. Do I know if there's a way to download only certain parts of the mod or delete certain parts? Yeah, you can pick and choose like what you want to do to some degree. Yeah, you can just look through it all. When you're like dragging and dropping the files, just pick and choose what you want to do and what you don't want to do. Delete things after that. I tinker with mods all the time, make them behave slightly differently to suit my needs. I really like this mod. This is really well done. Mod designer, if you're out there, well done. Really like it. Mystery Dragon 99 nice to watch a stream of you for the first time <clears throat> Yeah 
The next one I want to do, well, you guys probably seen, I'll be getting into Minecraft, the Farming Valley mod for Minecraft. That's the next one I'm really going to get into because I think there's a huge amount of potential there. I just got to keep playing with it and figuring it out and learning it because I don't know Minecraft at all. But I'm going to. We'll get there. You'll see. Nice to see a live stream. Yeah, I might do another live stream tomorrow. We'll see. We'll see. I don't know what I'd do. Maybe another something or other, but we'll see. I got a whole bunch of ideas. I just got to figure out which ones I want to do. Oh yeah, this one does have a configure file, doesn't it? So you can. I, I just downloaded the mod today and played with it for the first time. I just went listening to other people tell me about it, so I don't really know a lot about this one. Never thought I'd catch a live stream. Yeah, I try and do them at different times. Anyways, tomorrow's winter. We can see what the winter crops do. My Minecraft stream was torturous. Yeah, a lot of people were loving that. That was hilarious. Why don't I sell everything on the last day of the month? I guess I could. Too late now, but I mean, I see your point. Here's my expenses. 32000 again. That seems pretty consistent. I'm not sure what that's based on. Here's everything bare bones. But of course, the winter trees produce fruit in winter. Look at that. You can finally make money through winter. I am actually curious to see what these are worth because now in the normal game you can like work to get these trees for winter. You could have a mega crop of these and produce all winter. Please notice me, si smiley shine. Well, since you're asking so nicely, I will. So there we go. Three, three, and three. Persimmon? Not the same as a tomato. I have no idea what this even is. A fig? A really sweet fruit. Okay. Pear, the sexy fruit, from that pear shape, I would assume. And here's my slimes. Pretty cool, huh? Watch it up if you hit him with a sword. They all die. Oh, I got a dwarf scroll. Cool. Good work, slimes. The tax is high, 32k. Yeah. You subbed? Cats on brooms? Congratulations. Thank you. Everyone else, subscribe. It's important. Subscribe for good karma or something. Um, okay, well, let's see what the winter thinks. So, if you had nine trees in winter, this is what, what, what it would produce you. Wait, pears don't bear, bear fruit in winter? Well, mine just did. So, 828 gold, that's not bad from this three trees that would give you fruit but they, do they do it every day let's go look the sexy fruit yeah i love when they add that kind of humor into things they don't they're not just like a green fruit that's good for stuff they're like the sexy fruit that's a nice touch i encourage that mod designers good work again okay so they produce every day so i get 900 gold every day so that's low 20,000 gold for the entire month and all I gotta do is pick the three fruit every day so that's really good. So if I had 10 times as much there's 200,000 gold. Congrats for 70k! Oh thank you yeah I hit that the other day. You know we're gonna go I, I wanna go do something. It's been bugging me all stream. Actually first we're gonna check the fruit cave. No we're not. We're not gonna check that. We're gonna go for a little journey right now. We're on a mission. Some of you probably already figured out what I'm doing. Just subbed? Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I need to expand on my games. Stardew Valley. I'm running out of content for it. There's just not much to do. I gotta bring in a new crowd of people. I'm thinking the Minecraft Farming Valley will be a good start. Beyond that, I'm not sure what else. Hello Neighbors coming out in its full version. Uh, I think Tuesday? So I'll definitely be playing that. Whether or not I make a lot of videos on it, I don't know. But I do really like that game. It's a lot of fun. Try to get into that. Please share your save. Roblox is garbage. But that's a big market. I've never played Roblox. I watched J Mac play it. That was about it. Um what do we need for this mission of mine? Prismatic shard. This one. Dark shrine of selfishness. Your children will turn into doves and fly away. Yes. Goodbye. C go say hi to mom while you're at it. Though to be fair, she's not dead. She's just not here anymore. 
she just got a little divorce. Player unknown. Yeah, I play Player Unknown's Battleground way too much, but it's such a different market that I just I can't really make that transition. And I don't want to. It takes so much work to get good at PUBG. Like I've already played I think 250 hours. I'm still terrible. And everyone like no one uh no one wants to watch my playstyle. I'm too like calculated and slow. You gotta have like a fast paced playstyle for people to like that. Play Stardew Valley. Yeah, well, if I could find another game, I would happily jump onto it, but there's just nothing yet that really compares to Stardew Valley. That's why I'm still playing it. Like, there's so many other games, and I'm like, hey, this game looks good. Then I play it for two days, and I'm like, oh, it's done. There's nothing else I can do. But with Stardew Valley, it's almost a year and a half later, and I'm still here going strong. That's why Stardew Valley is such an amazing game. A Harvest Moon playthrough might be interesting, actually. I might do that. The Long Dark? Yeah, I do have that. I do play it. Maybe I'll stream that a bit tomorrow. I'm stuck. No, I'm not stuck. I just stopped moving. I know what's going on. I just gotta increase my move speed. Tripping over words today? I trip over words every day. That's why I edit so heavily usually. That way no one has to know. I'd watch PUBG in a heartbeat? Hmm. I probably will stream PUBG a bit, but I probably won't upload it afterwards. It'll be like a something PewDiePie does. You just do the game but don't uh don't upload the stream afterwards play more Staxel when it gets more developed yeah Staxel looks pretty good it, it's got a long ways to go though like it was crashing a lot and I was having issues and getting mad at it it's got potential though it really does Starbound maybe actually I gotta add that to a list for a sec hold the phone this is one of the great things about live streaming too I bounce ideas off people And that works. Now, it's been a while since I've done this. It's always hard to find that sweet spot. I'm probably moving too fast. That's the problem. I just want to go see what's going on up here. I haven't been up here in a long time. I said Denver did a video on it the other day. PUBG is interesting in any play style. Yeah, it is. But mine's so slow. Because I'll like really methodically move in. Like It's a good win ratio type thing, but... It's boring. It's not a lot of kills. Every time I win, it's like five kills on average. You tip over words less in voice chat though. Yeah, but I'm usually doing less things in voice chat. When I'm streaming, I'm doing a bunch of different things. I'm watching the chat. I'm watching my obs thing. I'm trying to play. I'm drinking water. I'm texting people. I'm checking my Twitter. All the things I shouldn't be doing. Okay, I don't know how to get up there anymore. Maybe it doesn't work. Okay, I'm going back. What is the purpose of the dice under the gold bar? Why this thing here? That tells me my luck for the day. That's part of the... Uh, what mod is that? One of the other mods that tells me... I think that's a UI info suite. So it tells me everything I need to know when I want to know it. So there we go. Tells me my luck. Tells me uh, the sprinkler range, I think, if I press the right button. Or if I go to places sprinkler, at least it'll tell me the range of that. Tells me where people are. Tells me the crops, when they're ready to go. Stuff like that. Animals need to be pet. What's in my greenhouse today? Haven't been in here in a while. Mary the Dwarf? Uh, that mod isn't working last I checked. Otherwise, I would. That's what my greenhouse looks like these days. Kegs. Fruit. Fruit trees. That's a way to do it. Can you shout me out? Cyberlord Master Gamer? Sure. There you go. There's your shout out. Do I have a favorite Harvest Moon game? You know, I'm not sure anymore. It's been so long since I played. I played a bunch of them, like a lot of hours. I just didn't, you know, it's been so long. Play Undertale. Yeah, there's a bunch of things I could play, but for now, not going to bother. Look at Pam and her winter getup. That's one thing we could do. Let's go see where everyone, uh, see what everyone looks at, looks like in their winter clothes for now. And what we can do for that. The Stalker mod. So these here look different. Penny, Jazz, and Pam. George. Haley. Emily. Anyone else look different? Sebastian. Leah has a scarf. So now if I go to the map, it'll show me where everyone is that I clicked on. Leah's at her house. Whatever. We'll go say hi to someone just for fun. 
I should stream the Connor versus Floyd fight. <laughs> Definitely not going to do that. That's very illegal. Very against the rules. And I just want to sit there. I really want to watch it, like, focus on it. So I'm just definitely going to be sitting there, like, glued to the TV in HD. Um, who is I going to look for? Where's my list? People, come here. Uh, Penny? We'll go see Penny. She'll be in her trailer with Pam. Well, Pam won't be there. No, she's not there. Where is she? Where is Penny right now? Library. Boom. Let's go see her. <clears throat> oh, she's below the library. Please leave me alone. I get that a lot. She got earmuffs and a scarf. Yeah, there's a lot of nice little touches to this mod that are a nice surprise. Jazz, the little monster. You can play with my dolls if you want to. Just make sure to brush your hair, their hair when you're done. I'm not doing anything with you, Jazz. You're a psychopath. Hey, DF. I'm late, but hello. Hello, Kawaii. I bet the DF will not read this and notice when me when I try. Cutie Creations 15. <clears throat> okay, anyways, I think I've about covered this mod in as much as I'm going to cover it. So, yeah. Uh, I've got some other videos, all sorts of other mods. If you haven't seen it before, go check it out now. My channel is full of this kind of crap. New videos up all the time, blah, blah, blah. Thanks for showing up. Thanks for donating. Thanks for commenting. Um, yeah. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Probably stream tomorrow. Thanks. Bye.